What's up, YouTubers and official dronies? This is Mike for Drones Are Eagles. Oh my God, I hate walking up these hills. Whew. Especially when it's starting to get hot. But how is everybody doing? Thank you for being here. Again, here I am at McPherson Park, also known as Needle Park, giving out medical supplies. If you're new to the channel, please like and subscribe. Make sure you hit that notification bell so you'll be notified every time I go live. Thank you again for everybody being here across the pond, down under, all over the world, all continents. Thank you for being here. Oh, man. What a day, what a day. Haven't seen Eagle for, for you squirrely fans um, haven't seen eagle since i released them which that's a good sign right that's a good thing right um, <clears throat> that is a good thing poor eagle poor eagle um, oh man there's a syringe box they're picking up syringes that's good See how they're cleaning? Somebody said, why don't they clean? Every time I come down here, they're cleaning somewhere. You know, they're cleaning somewhere. There's a police officer harassing people again. Like, go harass the drug dealers. I mean, really, like, I never see them harass drug dealers down here. You know, I see them all the time. They stare at me. They, they watch me. They're looking at me, you know, and, uh, you know, selling drugs to everybody. But I see these cops never harass them or do anything to them or say anything to them all they're worried about is telling the addicts to move it up pick up your tent let's get out of here move it like you see him across the street that's where i'm headed right now um boy, boy, i bet you he feels good man he feels real good that's the only thing they do all right some of you guys get on me about the cops <laughs> hey listen i know my true intentions here i love cops i just don't like the cops here you know this is all they do, they chase them away, but they never help them when they're dying, when they're overdosing, they don't help. Uh, all they do is chase them away, that's all they do. And you see somebody's arguing with them because it's true, leave them alone, go bother the dealers. Go bother the dealers. Oh God, go bother the dealers, man. They're not bothering you. Smoking a bump. Oh, I can't stand this, the smell of weed. I hate it. I hate the smell of weed. I hate the smell of weed. But did you notice that? What's wrong with that picture? Here, here, a coffin back there. What's wrong with that picture? If that was in South Philadelphia, she'll be in handcuffs right now because that cop is right there. You tell me that cop can't smell it? I smelled it before I turned the corner. You know, he smells it, but then again, they, they were told not to do nothing about it, you know. Um, but in South Philly, yeah, she would have been arrested for smoking marijuana right there in front of him. Don't even try to hide it. So like I was saying, guys, by no means am I picking on the cops. I love cops, man. I really do. Uh, we need cops. Without cops, man, we'll be all dead probably. You know, I, I love cops. They do a wonderful job. Um, they got families and kids, you know, and, and I pray that they all make it home to see their, you know, kids again. Just like when I come out here, I pray that I get to go back and see my Elias, you know, and my other kids. But um, it's just the cops down here, you know. Yeah, I, I know the part where they tell them, you know, not to arrest nobody, you know, leave people alone. I get all that. I understand all that. But the part I don't like, and I'm going to repeat myself over and over again, is that I've seen them not help when people are ODing. When people overdose and they're dying, they just sit there and, and call it in with the walkie-talkie. They put their gloves on like they're going to do something, but they don't do nothing. And I've, and I've seen addicts, plenty of addicts, uh, Right, right, right above, right over the police officer's shoes, giving CPR, 
rubbing their chest, trying to bring them back. When the call, officers sitting there, trained, trained, all officers trained in medical, uh, you know, and I just, they don't want to touch, they don't want to help, you know. Uh, so I don't even know why they're here. Um, if, if they're told not to do nothing, you know, not to arrest nobody, well, then leave them alone. Don't tell them to pack up and move their tents. Like, leave them alone. If you're not going to arrest them for doing drugs, then don't. Are you going to arrest them for, for having, having a tent? Like, it doesn't make any sense, you know? Leave them alone. If you're not going to do nothing else, leave them alone. Let them sleep there. <clears throat> Unless you're going to put them in a hotel. You see, that's the only problem I have here with the police officers. That's the only, only issue I have. Look at that dog. It's a sin. That's the only issue I have. Oh, my God. I hope my camera's not seen. Oh, God. I'm in the area where I don't like where I said that I'm going to wear my glasses. This is the area where I said that I'm going to put on my glasses when I come through here. Uh, and, and, and like I said, for the people that are watching, I'm not afraid of nobody. I'm not afraid of any situation. I'm afraid to get into some shit where, where I'm going to have to defend my life and, and then be investigated, be hauled in for questioning and all this crazy shit. Uh, probably still get charged will have to fight it in court you know self-defense probably will have to pull a camera from one of these stores to show that it's self-defense um, that's what I don't want to get into um, and this is why I don't, you don't never see me stop here because it's it's, a, it's across the street usually. Um, that's why you never see me filming across the street. Um, it's usually across the street where everything is going on, and um, I try to keep a low profile. I try not to look across the street. I try not to point my camera that way. You know, uh, like I said, I don't want no problems. Uh, I need to come down here. Uh, I need to come down here to. Have problems. Let me fix this camera. You hear that? At two twenty. At two twenty p.m. They just said on the on the radio. Everybody's cell phones, TVs, and everything's gonna go off. Uh, it's like a test or something. I don't know if it's just the East Coast, uh, 11:20 West Coast time. I don't know. But if it's that, 11:20 West Coast, 2:20 East Coast, I'm supposed to shut off the TVs, like a message or something. And I hope this is recording and until I hope this is recording um, oh my god this is a mess down here guys oh my god One more, Jeff. <laughs> Oh, they're taking shopping carts. Oh my god, they're taking their shopping carts too? Oh my god. Seriously? They're taking that's nice. I've never seen a police officer litter like that. He just threw his gloves on the ground. That's nice. So what's next? They're gonna throw them away? They're gonna throw them out now? Look at the tents across the street. Unbelievable. 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 Uh, there's the live camera across the street let's go to the live camera let's go check out the live camera
that's right across the street. Right over there. Here's the light camera. Right above that yellow sign. Right above the yellow sign to the right. All the way up to the roof. Little white dot. That's the camera. Look at this trash. Unbelievable. Look at this. This is like walking through a war zone. Look at all the yellow caps. Look at all the yellow caps on the ground. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Uh, people scratch their head too much, man. They do jump. People say they don't jump. Yes, they do. They might not jump out of your head, but they do jump when you're scratching like that. Because you're, it's like you're knocking them out of your head when you're scratching like that. And I'm talking about lice. Yeah, they don't jump like sleeves. But when you're scratching like that constantly, scratching back and forth like Amber was doing, oh, they're going to fly right off of there. Um, God. Woo. What are they doing across the street? <laughs> Looks like they're, they're busy today, the cops. They're busy today. They're busy today. So it's not going on here. I got 11 minutes cut time. Uh, uh, this, shit, this is crazy. Uh, let's see what they're doing. I think they're collecting shopping carts. Yeah, they're making them take the things off the shopping cart. I'm dying, I'm gonna die when I Yeah, they collect all shopping carts. Wow. They collect all shopping carts. Oh god. They collect all shopping carts. Wow, wow, they're collecting shopping carts. <laughs> God, are you serious right now? <laughs> they're collecting shopping carts. Look at that. Unbelievable. Yeah, because we, we, you know, we don't want the city to lose any money, right? Of course not. You know, let's collect, let's collect the shopping carts, you know? <sighs> let's, not, let's not worry about that guy with the shopping cart that he needs a place to stay. You know what I mean? He needs medical treatment. Let's not, you know, let's not talk to him about that. Or, or try to tell him, you know, it's best to go into treatment. It's best to get off the street. Let's not say that. Just, just take his card off of him. Uh, great job, man. Great job. Listen, man, I know it's going to come in this comments. You can hate all you want. I don't give a damn no more. Say whatever you want to say. Say whatever you want to say. I got mods that can delete your stupid comments. Uh, so, write whatever you want to write. What? That guy was over there. Yes. Let me get it out for him. Remember the black guy that had that thing on his arm? I want to give him some. I, I got ace bandages for him. Let me get it now so I can give it to him. I don't want to dig for it in front of everybody, but let me get it out now. I forgot all about that. I got the ace bandages. Get that out. Where'd I put the mat? Let me see. Um, here they go, right here. The ace, ace bandages. I'll give him two. He's gonna need two of these. Um, let me give him some antibiotics for that arm. If you know what, you'll see. You'll see who I'm talking about, guys. Uh, remember the black guy? That he, his arm. His, I think his right arm was like real nasty looking from the um, from the uh, trench. 
So I'm gonna give I'm gonna give him two of these because he was with a female. But uh, you see, it has the water. I think it's called saline. Saline. I forgot what it's called. Then you got syringe. You got bandages, triple antibiotics, iodine, gloves, pads on the back. I mean, big. These are bigger bags. So I'm gonna give him two because he's with a friend over there. And I'm gonna give him these. Oh, let me give him. Um, what was it? Let me give him. Let me see. Is it in here? Let me see. Is it in here? Uh, yeah, give me some. Man, one of two of these. Two of these. Uh, hey, and let me get the bag out too. <laughs> you remember that, guys? I got the bags. Oh, my knee's starting to kill me now. I see. My knee's starting to hurt. Um, I think it's in here. Yeah, here it is. I'm gonna give him two of these. Two of these. So, and then the bags are right here, guys. Yay! Look, I got the bags. Yay! Got the bags. <laughs> I got the bags. I got the bags. I got the bags. Right. So, oh, I gotta put this in there. Forgot about this. Put this in there. There you go. This will be the end of my video. So I got two, two ace bandages, uh, two gauze, two of these, uh, triple antibiotics, and two of the care packages. One for him and one for uh, his lady friend. So let's let's go give him that. Let's go give him that. Uh. Oh. Just remember. He was the one that I was talking about. That some some uh, black lady comment on one of my videos. That she loves my content. She loves everything that I'm doing. But she can't help to notice that I pass black people. That I don't give black people medical supplies. <laughs> so this guy was one of them that I showed I said look I've been giving him supplies for months now um, and it's not just that that uh, uh, a lot of them don't have wounds I just don't give anybody supplies um, you know but this guy got wounds here you you'll see him but uh where's he at uh, please I hope he didn't leave well, he was just here. Oh, there he goes. Yo, my man. Yo, my man. I gave you supplies last time I saw you. For your arm, remember? Here's, I got some more stuff here for you. Here, look. I got ace bandages, bud. I got ace bandages and stuff in here for you, all right? There's two of these bags, one for your lady friend and one for you, all right? Here you go. I don't want to throw it on the ground, all right? Here you go, my man. I don't want to throw it on the ground, all right? Take care of yourself, man. Uh, I think I think he lost the bag because he, he, he was talking to me, but he couldn't get his eyes off the ground. I think he lost the bag. Uh, yeah, I think that's what happened. Uh, uh, again, I forgot to give him Tom's cross. Tom, I will give your crosses out, okay? Trust me, I'll give them out, okay? I will just... Uh, I remember him. I don't know if he saw his arm or not, but his arm doesn't look too good. Um, so, trust me, Tom, I will be giving out your crosses, okay? Um, so, I, I believe this will be the end of this one. Let me check. Oh, yes, definitely. This is the end of this one. Uh, that guys, thank you for being here. Uh, make sure you check me out tomorrow. I will have another upload for you. All week, I will have one for you guys. Uh, make sure you check out my live streams 11 30 a.m. And thanks everybody for being here Thank everybody. Uh, please share my links and I got GoFundMe and you know And the most important is my Amazon wish list where you see medical supplies like that come from my Amazon wish list The link is in the description of all, any of my videos 
um, please help and donate medical supplies. Um, and I also still accept peanuts for the squirrels. That is also on my Amazon wish list. So thank you again for watching across the pond, everywhere, down under. Thank you. Love is the key, drama free. Heal the past, live the presence, and dream the future. Love, health, peace, and happiness to all. Love you guys. Take care of yourself. This is Mike for Drones Our Eagles. Ciao. You, I don't ever feel calm I can feel the sweat inside my palms Play with me like cats and a string You don't understand the pain it brings You don't ever wanna give me wings You don't ever wanna set me free You know I'm addicted to you And it's twisted you've been gifted with the evil voodoo Got me coming back from all